Hello everybody out there, this is Utsasang from TechCrackers and today I'm going to show you how to use Shadowplay in any NVIDIA model, NVIDIA graphics model, graphic card model. So let's get started right away. I just press Windows E. Till then, first I'll, I did this for experiment. I will delete this. Now. I'll go go to whatever drive you have your window installed. Now in I have a 64 bit computer so I have pre program files and program files x86. If you have a 32 uh, 32 bit computer you won't have this pro program files x86 folder. But what you have to do is go to program files x86 folder and scroll all the way down to hey Nvidia Corporation. If you are 32 bit com computer, it will be here in program files folder. Now I'll just for the press G. Here you go. GF, GF, e, GF experience. Sorry. You don't have to do this with this. With this exe, but GF experience.exe. But there is one thing you need to make sure is that you have the default GeForce experience that came. Uh, that was in the DVD uh, that you uh, that was installed using the DVD not the updated one so I will first show you how to do it now what you have to do is in the properties tab press the target button and uh, target one target bar scroll all the way to right and outside the double quotation now press uh, first press the hyphy uh, first the space bar then hyphy that is pre pretty much the uh, what is it mm, subtract sign sorry now type in shadow play okay now you are all done good now i'll just run it till then now in case you when you open it up you find it shows something like an installer or something uh, if you degraded your version using a clean installer from the dvd that came with your nvidia gpu so it will most probably show an installer or something so i uh, first turn on the uh, show hidden files option Mm, it's right here show hidden files I've already took already checked it so go to program data folder in the C drive okay, let it open now open up the NVIDIA corporation folder okay now it will be something like NVIDIA GeForce experience in case this is the logs a GeForce experience yeah this one was in my case this folder had an update named folder which had the latest versions file actually they are backup files from my previous installation all I did was delete them so when I started the GeForce experience uh, the shadow play one I actually got the shadow play mode on now make sure you delete all the future update files you or else it won't this trick won't work so now actually you would have guessed actually in my case I have a GT 710 so now what is now why I'm using this trick is that Nvidia hasn't given uh, this you know feature in GT models only in the GTX 600 and above in my case it is even better so I use this trick to turn on shadow play and it works like charm well till it opens I will just pause it I guess yeah now guys as you can see it has started to load up at first it will load the default Nvidia GeForce experience see uh, file don't be surprised but suddenly it will switch to the nvidia shadow play mode okay let's just now it was it will show not responding in my case i have a very old computer you know okay let's 
let's just wait now if you are following our videos you may have noticed that we recently up uploaded a sky 5 video sky 5 crack video but you may also have noticed that there are no links in the description don't worry uh, by 15 uh, March 6 16 17 or March end, we will do a live stream giveaway f for those links so uh, all you have to do is subscribe to us to win every 10 out of 50 and stuff will be will get the links person will send the links personally to them okay so let it happen let it happen and wait for it wait for it wait for it till then i will just press f5 and don't need to press f5 six minutes will take a long time to end it, but cool enough as you can see it is loading because the cpu says is at 100 percent so we'll do okay i will pause it it will take some time in my case but hopefully it won't in your case though so well guess what i'm gonna pause so yeah guys as you can see it is taking a lot of time and i found a reason because the service was not working properly sometimes it happens so all you have to do is press sorry windows r for run and type in services dot msc it will open up the services service management console let it open up well it is taking a shit load time so i actually did this now click on this and press n on your keyboard to find the nvidia G first oh, you have to do do is restart the GeForce Experience service. It has been restart, not refresh, restart. So I just restarted it like just now. So it is, it is not giving me the restart option, but it will work. All you have to do is turn it on and stuff. First, start it. That was the problem. Strain it, stream on it, but not running. Restart. No better. You see, it's not running, but it is. Strength option. Now, cool. All of it, all of this stuff is running now. So well. Actually, last time it a GeForce Experience service was was on like 0 0.2 and stuff. Now it's bursting up. So let's just wait till it opens up i guess okay so guys in my case i don't know why it is taking a long time i guess i will have to restart but when you will start it it will start in the shadow play screen first it will come this classic geforce then it will flicker on first it will not responding then it will flicker on to your shadow play mode so well guys thanks for watching um please like make sure to like share and subscribe to our channel well it helps a lot thanks for watching again